Ready? Hi, I'm Jeff Denson. I'm here at Fantasy Studios in Berkeley, California with my brand new quartet recording our next album, Concentric Circles. So the concept of this album deals with bringing together these two groups of people, or two, two separate trios and merging them into one group. Another concept of the interlocking or interlacing circles for me is how the music, the different voices in the music lock together. A lot of the, the, the compositions on this album involve counterpoint between voices, between the bass, piano, the bassoon, and my voice. And some of these pieces are so intertwined, it's kind of like a Swiss watch where all the wheels are turning and the pieces are interlocking together. You've always told the line and found life you've dreamed was for somebody else. I've composed all new music for this recording and I really thought about the players I'm playing with and how to incorporate their talents and voices into the music. And it really covers a wide array of textures and energies. In my new band is featured the bassoonist extraordinaire Paul Hansen, drummer Alan Hall, and pianist Dan Zemmelman. This is a very unique instrumentation on this album. In fact, I don't know of any other jazz quartet that uses this instrumentation of piano, bass, and drums as the core rhythm section that's the most common rhythm section for jazz. But then the horn we have is bassoon. I don't know of any other human being that plays bassoon like Paul Hansen. In addition to having such a unique horn, we use my voice as a horn in, in harmonizing together and singing, in singing unison and harmony parts or counterpoint together. It's a very unique sound, and the bassoon is a wonderful instrument for this group, I think, because it's very complementary to the sound of the double bass. Bode, double bass, and bassoon share a very common, similar timbre. And at the same time, bassoon has a very vocal-like quality, like a human, a deep male voice. So I can play with those sonorities of both teaming the double bass with the bassoon and my voice with the bassoon. And then the fact that Paul is such an incredible, incredibly exciting improviser is a natural choice no matter what the instrumentation is. Just He brings an incredible power when he improvises. After the last three albums, I really wanted to go back to recording my original music music that I composed for a specific group and allow me to really explore the use of counterpoint and the rhythmic language that I've been, that I hear. Um, and working with these guys in particular, it, it's, it's kind of, I found a group of guys that I have great rapport with, both socially and musically, and they're inspiring to write for because they have very unique voices and, and together it's, um, it really allows me to explore many different musical terrains. So I've been, I've been waiting for this chance.